So we got the TikTok money glitch that ruined everybody's life. Motherfuckers just want to scam all day. You missed the PPP loan. That's it. Don't don't try all the new ones. They found out already. But let's let's get straight into it. <laughs> Why would anyone ever see a TikTok money glitch and run straight to the bank? No, a set is heavy. It is lined up. No, this shit is elephant. What? A whole line at Chase Bank to do fraud is crazy. Y'all be bugging out, man. Listen, I know it's tough times. Just take, get some extra hours. Go hustle. Stay home. No. Only it's safe to say this TikTok money glitch just ruined so many people's lives, as for some reason, people think it's a good idea to try a TikTok money glitch now you may be asking what is this glitch well the short version is it's check fraud and if you are dumb enough to actually do this you will be financially ruined and likely go to jail for this but there are a handful of scams going on currently the main money glitch people are talking about is there's apparently some glitch in the chase banking app where you can deposit a large check that is bad and then you have a short time limit to actually withdraw the money in cash from the atm before the check is clear and i guess absolute what? idiots they're doing this on their own accounts and then you have other people who are naive enough and didn't know better you're doing fraud on your own account is crazy at, le at least be like the other scammers and be like do you guys got chase do you guys got td bank we can make some money gang fuck out of here <laughs> to let scammers do this to their accounts but clearly the bank started to crack down on this and ended up freezing all the accounts involved with these shady transactions That's what you get so here you have a chase customer getting their accounts frozen while trying to do the money glitch i knew it i knew it i told you i told you what happened <laughs> bro i knew it do my vtm bro Chase, I knew that the f with Chase. Chase, uh. I guess in 2024, people are just posting videos angry because Chase Bank will let them steal money from them. Honestly, <laughs> this whole clip just gives off the energy of this viral clip. It was just Hi, a sir, little... I'm here to pick up your daughter. Absolutely not. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Chase Bank will let me open. Listen, if you scam it, I'm judging you. I know, remember the Instagram scam where everybody lost their account. I'm judging you because y'all y'all literally were put on the page. Like there'd be a million people on one person's page. Hi, I'm Jessica Bakerfield, and I just got my three hundred dollars from Cash App. Uh, tap in with my guy, Scam McScammer, and you'll get your three hundred today. And that's how we know y'all lost your account because that's you posted that video. He posted that video of you on his account so you guys can get your account back and still didn't get it back. You got double scams. Crazy. Overdraft my account by 10 grand because that's what ended up happening when the checks finally cleared and they had already taken out the cash. What is my life? What is my life? Why do I have 11,000 missing from my bank account? Because you is did fraud. Is this humorous to you guys? Like, do you, yeah, is, it, is it a kiki ha 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 moment for y'all, bro? Yes. I work very hard for my money. Tell me why I, I, I check my bank account. I, I work very hard for my money. Bro, you wrote a check and tried to cash it out of your own account that didn't have that much money. Stop it. After I hear about this, about this Chevy Chase, whatever, I'm missing eleven thousand from my Chase account. My, I don't need. I, I don't know whether to feel sad or to feel mad, bro. I like I'm in shock right now, bro. I have goosebumps like all over my body. Like I, I, I don't know what to feel, bro. Is this how a crash out starts? Like I dead want to drive my car through a goddamn McDonald's and. I don't know what's stupider. You doing the fraud or you making the video showing you did the fraud? Yeah, you getting arrested, my guy. Say f it all, but this is like eleven thousand from. But why, but why would this is is this funny? This is not. Yes. Good, bro. This is not demure, bro. Hilarious. Get us. Demure has been a popular word for like one month, and I'm already over it. Is committing <laughs> check fraud at Thanks. Chase Bank, brat? 
or demure? Let me know in the comments down below. I feel like that's the nope. new flavor of brain rot content that's currently circulating on Instagram. Because the other day, I pulled an Instagram reel that said something around the lines of, is Sonic the Hedgehog demure or brat? And at that point, I just turned off the whole phone. But I noticed that this dude <laughs> has the exact same screenshot of his bank account as the other dude. Bro, what the f***? Man, I know I should have linked him to the man. What the bro, bro told me tap in, bro. Bro said he got the job a day before the kicker happened, bro. What as soon as you say tap in, whether it does with any type of hustling, I think you're a scammer. Tap in. Tap in with me, guy. Tap in. Tap in. We'll make some money. Automatically, when you hear tap in, scam. Like, yo, 50 tap in. No queue up. Uh, uh, uh. I'm like, I bet this is my only shit, bro. My only mother account, bro. And they gonna whack this. <laughs> bro. The f All right. So, the f man. What y'all need to do, man? Y'all follow me. Y'all make this shit go viral, man. This chase glitch. Don't do this shit, man. Y'all don't do this. Y'all save y'all account, get your money. Otherwise, man, this this sell. Uh, bow, don't do it. Sounds hear stupid. ye, hear ye, I'm out. So one of them might be real, or we're just seeing multiple people just LARPing as self-inflicted victims. And then you had this guy with an alleged like a negative fake victim. forty grand balance. Damn, negative forty thousand balance is crazy. Man, they really told me to tap in. Next day, I was supposed to clear. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Account, yo? Every time you hear tap in, just know you about to get scammed. You are about to <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Every time they told me to tap in, gang. And look at me now. I, I might need $38,728. Man, you did it to your damn self. Like I said, pick up some extra damn shifts, man. I know life is hard. A lot of people don't even make that much money in a year these days. Stop it. <laughs> Bro, what the? <laughs> this one seems the <laughs> fakest out of all of them because who just records themselves, like, just wiping their face aggressively? <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> like, it seems try hard. There's a lot of it actual is. people that this happened to, but from what I'm seeing, there's so many videos of these people promoting it, and they're all getting wiped, unfortunately, before I could download them all. So these super viral videos of these people being really upset with massive negative balances, I'm guessing they're fake, but I did find some videos that didn't go super viral, so I wouldn't be surprised if these super viral videos that are still up are probably fake, because, I mean, who wants to snitch on themselves like that? Or Unfortunately, a lot of people, as we've actually covered on this channel here before. <laughs> but hey, I mean, at least there's a little bit of hope on TikTok. Y'all, I want to hit that chase play so bad right now, bro. I'm seeing people, my close friends, going up 20, 30K, running it up on chase. I see somebody just hit 90K on, on, on Twitter. But I just know if I hit that play, God going to use me to be the example. I just... This guy got a glass chain on. Now, he, he might need to do the scam. That chain, that chain ain't it. <laughs> No, he is. So let me just go ahead and praise him. You got a Gucci but link. Then, there's just so many others that just rip away what little hope I have. That ass. Don't be confused in the beginning. Those girls were selling butt. Looking stupid. I can only hope that's a skit. What's the upside of posting that video? Bro, like, what you do, bro? Like, you, you said Wait, move your head. Ago, bro. How like, much? Do you know how much trouble you got me? Look, they calling me right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold up. Okay, so this guy has a, a fake screenshot of a negative $99 billion. <laughs> That's Let's crazy. Go. But uh, speaking of snitching on yourselves, 
um, I found these two posts, which seem a little bit more real. As you see with the both of these screenshots, day one, $100. Day two, a whole lot more. But still, I'm trying to figure out why would anyone document themselves doing this? It just Word. it doesn't make sense. The upside is what? Attention and clout. The downside is fraud charges. Word. Like, hello? Jail time. But hey, I mean, I guess quick money, no matter the consequences, is attractive to some people. But people also have to remember, there is no such thing is free money especially if it's a viral trend called the tiktok chase money glitch that just sounds like a great way to get arrested but then you have videos like this twins twins i'm, I'm not even gonna lie i'm not even supposed to condone in this type of behavior due to the duration that i'm trying to project my life in but that chase bait play looking too sweet right now twins no cap. no i can just hit one chase bait play i, I can buy so many shabigs like Twins is hitting for, so many for what? 30, 40 balls, 50 balls. Like, you know how many Shabiz that can get me? Thankfully, this guy was only Wait, hold on. talking to Is that a new word? Shabigs? Shadigs? What did he say? Don't in this type of behavior due to the duration that I'm trying to project my life in. But that Chase Bait play looking too sweet right now, Twins. No cap. I can just hit one Chase Bait play. I, I can buy so many Shabigs. Like, what the hell is a shabig? I'm not I'm not tap I'm not tapped in. Please let me know what shabig is in the comments. I'm not sure about that one. Twins is hitting for for 30, 40 balls, shabigs. 50 balls. Like, you what know how many shabigs that? that can get me? Thankfully, this guy was only talking about it, even though he was tempted, but his comments are just filled with people either claiming they've done this glitch or fishing for victims to try to like trick them into essentially scamming them. If you got chase, let me know. Someone PMO. If you got chase, let me know. How do you withdraw it all at once? PMO, who who got chase? Let me know. I got oh chase. God. Oh no. That's bad news. Who are the guys that, were the guy who said I got chase? It was a bad day in a life for him. Money glitch isn't kiting. Kiting is apparently when you open multiple bank accounts and you send various amounts of money to each bank account and kiting. they essentially just keep paying each other off and you're essentially just i guess exploiting the latency of the banking system as the first account you deposit 100 you send the second account 200 dollars then you send the third account 300 dollars then the third account sends the fourth account 400 dollars and the fourth account sends the 400 back to the first account <laughs> yeah that sounds like some fucking 2k money glitch scam that they found out early before they do the update. And then suddenly you have some money left over and then like three overdrafted accounts. But the crazy thing about, I guess, like advanced scams is it, it takes so much effort that you might as well just make money legally because then you don't have the downside and it's almost the same amount of effort. But the people Work. who are trying to scam others in the comments here, I'm assuming is like some sort of advanced fee scam. And then you have this whole other scam going on in the midst of this, where if you access Chase ATMs with contactless, apparently the ATM doesn't close out from your account when you withdraw your cash you have to click that you're finished on the pad and apparently it's different from when you insert the card because when you insert the card once you take the card out you don't have access when you do the contact list you technically still have access because it's just a beat so now you have people putting glue in the slots to where people insert their cards what? they have to use the contact list and then they just walk after them and bank on the fact that they don't close out their bank account before they leave the atm and then they would draw their own money from that person's account. The world of scamming what is just hell? an all around terrible place, but there is definitely some funny, uh, funny things coming from this. So here I have a tweet saying like yesterday, a glitch in Chase Bank's system allowed people to withdraw funds they weren't entitled to, prompting the bank to place a seven day hold on the affected accounts. As a consequence, Chase accounts holders who participated in this glitch are now dealing with massive negative balances as well as seven day hold on their accounts. And then they post this video, which has to be a skit. <laughs> yeah. Grandma, not grandma. Hey, yo, hey, yeah. Hey, yo, I don't care how much money y'all scamming for. You ain't taking a credit card out my mouth with your mouth. Look what Diddy did. Look what Diddy did to the city. Kick the shaves. Kick the shaves. We having a Chevy party later. Bring all the Chevy honors out. I don't even like posting my accomplishments in life for all the That's an accomplishment? 
You up 100,000. Everybody going to eat tonight. Blue hunnets, blue cards. Like, this is clearly a parody of the people doing the money glitch. Motion picture money right there. Motion picture purposes. responded to all this. So we have a New York Post article that says TikTokers are trying to exploit a Chase Bank glitch and discovering it comes at a huge cost. Experts right. say glitch videos look an awful lot like check fraud, one of the oldest scams in the book. Videos urging customers at the bank to take advantage of a glitch quickly took off online, prompting people to deposit fake checks for large sums of money. But Chase quickly fixed the bug and is clawing back any money doled out to people who didn't deserve it. A spokesperson for Chase Bank told the Post consumers should be skeptical if something seems too good to be true. It likely is. We're aware of this incident and it has been addressed. Regardless of what you see online, depositing a fraudulent check and withdrawing the funds from your account is fraud, plain and it simple, is, the spokesperson added. But I mean, hey, at least we're getting some pretty entertaining stuff. It's, it's crazy how this has to be explained, like what fraud is, like it's it's like we're going backwards in life and yeah like edu the education system i blame the education system it's the same education system for decades and decades it needs to be changed we need to teach some financial stuff in the schools and i'm not talking about that bullshit financial class where they make you do a fucking uh, what is it the, the the dream team the 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 draft of the the teams that we you don't really own the teams and you get a team on your thing and then you fake own a team and then you lose that's not learning anything about finance skits out of all this what's your sign say who got chase you got chase that's a skit right that's I a hope. skit but i mean hey at least no one here <laughs> rammed a police officer with their wheelchair and lied about it on national tv like this guy did and you can check out that story here because it is just insane but other than that i'll see you guys next the, this whole thing is insane Stop scamming, guys. Let's let's stop the scam. Let's pick up pick up a pen. Go to the mall. This is what I used to do. I went to the mall. I got myself a pen. I dressed up, you know, kind of nice. You know, not too nice. You know, you get the button up and then below you wear the jeans. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you might wear some shoes. Maybe you might wear some sneakers. It don't matter. You know, show like, you know, up top, you're down for business. And from the bottom, you put in that work. You know what I'm saying? And you go, you go to the register of any store or wherever you go and just be like, hey, can I get a job application? And fill the shit out. Fill it out. Please, fill it out. Get the job. Work a whole year. And you might get that money. If you live with your parents, save that money. Tell them you're broke. That's what I did. Sorry, mom. <laughs> but for real, that's what you got to do sometimes. You got to take one for the team. You gotta miss out on some fun. If you want negative forty thousand, or, or do you want forty thousand in your account? You pick. What What do you want out of life? Do better, guys. This is this time to do better. These scams are the same scams being fucking said multiple times in different ways. It's the same damn scam. Just stop it. But yeah, today this was the TikTok money glitch from my guy, Tozy, explaining to us that. Only the world is getting stupider by the day, but let's stop it.